Hello friends, today we are going to learn sentence formation. But before that, we have to learn what is mean sentence. Sentence means a word, phrases or a clauses that convey proper meaning. It's called sentence. I have written definition for you. Look at these sentences. Me amba khato. This Marathi sentence, if we translate word to word, I mango eat. This is not sentence formation. The correct sentence formation is I eat mango. This is sentence formation of English because verb eat is a verb. Do kriya karko eat or object, it will come before verb. Then, dacha var kriya ho then, it is called object. Object comes after verb. So, ideal sentence formation of the sentence is subject plus verb plus object. And friend, subject could be noun and pronoun. And object also could be noun and pronoun. Look at this second example of Marathi, Ram Hushar Ahi. In this sentence, if we translate word to word, Ram Trevor is, this is wrong sentence formation. The correct sentence formation is Ram is clever. Again, is is verb, then Ram is subject and clever is complement. So we can say ideal structure is subject plus verb plus complement. Complement will come after verb and complement could be either adjective or adverb. Look at Ram eats slowly. In this sentence, Ram is a subject, it's verb and slowly is a complement, it is adverb. So here adverb is playing the role of complement. So ideal English sentence formation is subject plus verb plus object and subject plus verb plus complement. And my friends, in the sentence, the most important part of the sentence is verb. Without verb, we cannot form a sentence. Even a single verb can form a sentence. Look at this example. Go, za. This single verb is making sentence here because go can be proper meaning. So go is a single verb and it is sentence itself. So I hope you understand the sentence formation of English. Thank you.